What's good YouTube, it's I'm Pizza here from Division 1. Now today I do have the fastest VC grinding method out there. Uh, really simple, really quick. Uh, you do need to be a point guard with driving and finishing as your primary and secondary skill. Now this video may seem a little long for a grinding method but trust me it is worth it. You will be making 7000 plus every time you do it. Uh, I went from a 61 overall to an 82 in one night. It is the easiest method in the world. Trust me on this. Now, you do want to go straight into the NBA. Do not do the prelude games. Please do not do the prelude games. Um, once the free agency comes up, you want to scroll all the way down to the Warriors. Now they are going to decline you which is what you want that's what you want them to do you need to do 740 VC as your earnings no bonus no minutes uh, and one year that's it as you'll see here now you are going to keep on doing the counter offer until they decline you after you do it the three times I believe uh, you want to go to the Clippers. Um, when you go to the Clippers, make sure that your earnings are 600 this time. They have to be 600, no higher, no lower. Um, what else? Uh, it's the same thing as what you do with the Warriors. No minutes, no nothing. Just at 600 VC. That's it. Now... When you load in to your place, you want to play your first game. Now, you're not going to be able to play your first and second game. For me, it was my third. Oh, and make sure that your quarters are on 12 minutes and the difficulty is on pro. Has to be. All right? Trust me on that. Um, but like I was saying, you will play your third game. Now... What you need to do is, is record one stat in that game, like me. I just got a shooting foul, so I'm going to get free throws. Easy. I'm going to get one point because I missed my first shot because Brick City, boys. I suck at this game. I'm telling you. I'm trash. Uh, see, after I made that free throw, we are further up than 11. So you want to sim out of the game after that. And when it comes to this part, you have to thank the fans. You have to. It's going to give you the fan bonus, which is going to help you out for this. Now, when you go back to the locker room or whatever, you want to sim all the way to a game around January because you do need 100,000 fans in order to get your national uh endorsement I believe if I remember that correctly um while we are waiting here you should definitely check out our channel subscribe uh, please like the video show some support um now when that's done oh me I had to go a little bit past January which is fine uh, that's not important but whenever you do get the 100,000 fans Oh, no, I had to go to February. That's what it was. All right, but whenever you get the 100,000 fans and you do the national endorsement, you have to go with Foot Locker. You have to. And I'll stress this enough. You have to go with Foot Locker or else this method will not work. All right, so now that we are loading up into the national endorsement, like I said before, you do need to... Uh, pick Foot Locker. Now, after that, you do need to play a game. Uh, you do not need to record any stats. Just wait until your team is up by 11 or the enemy team is up by 11 and then just sim to the end. Now, after that match, you want to go to your endorsements and do a counter offer with Foot Locker. Now, when you do this, you have to make sure that the money is at 2500 uh, zero incentives and zero store discount. Uh, you have to do it, I believe, two to three times, and then they finally accept it. 
Um, after that, you do need to sim to March 30th for the next uh, for the next counter offer with uh, Foot Locker. All right, so with this next counter offer with Foot Locker, instead of it being 2,500, it needs to be 5,000 with zero insensitives and zero store discount. After you do this, like after they approve it, you do need to play one game and you need to record one stat just like the other game. Really simple. Alright, so in the next game, after you record your stat uh, and you leave, uh, go to the neighborhood and then accept all your endorsements and you will gain about 6,000 XP from that and then you're set. That's the whole glitch. Um, really simple, easiest glitch ever, trust me, uh, I'm about to show you, sim to the end. Alright, so this is where I'm going to show you how much VC you end up earning. Uh, you get the 5,000 from the Foot Locker, and then you get the two 500 endorsements, which will give you your 6,000. Um, plus you get that extra VC from the games that you played. You got the 600 plus, so whatever you earn from those games on top of the uh, 6,000, you earned over 7,000. So there you go, that's the whole glitch. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, please like and subscribe, like I said before. Uh, it would do us a huge favor. Uh, and thank you for watching the video. Peace out.